So I think one of the um, things that businesses need to keep in mind is that while they are used to, let's say, business to business, B2B, um, if they're starting on this journey of reconciliation, they might want to change and reframe their mindset um, where they're no longer thinking of Indigenous engagement for, let's say, business reasons, at, at least not at the outset, but it's more of a B2C, business to culture, right? Because at the outset, that's that's for sure what it's going to be, um, because you have to, you need that period to develop trust, relationships with the Indigenous community. The buy-in needs to come from the top, and you need to have a willingness of um, the front line supervisors and, and those who are going to be working with the Indigenous people to have a good understanding. And, and to have that good understanding, you have to be able to give them cultural awareness training. And when we've done that, we found that when Indigenous candidates are being placed into these corporations, which is new to them, it's a brand new world. Our people have not been in these corporations and so that corporate culture is new to them. And so when, when you have the supervisors and the managers that are going to be working with our people and they know the history, then I think that the communication and that respect uh, uh, is, is there and that patience and that kindness comes with it. For instance, if you were to go to another country to conduct business, you would probably want to know as much about that culture, um, the norms, the protocols, that sort of thing. You'd probably want to familiarize yourself with as much of that information as you could, um, just to ensure that things go uh, smoothly, uh, increasing any you know, probabilities of success that you're hoping for. So approaching the Indigenous community um, from that same point of view as if you were going to go to another country to conduct business, um, in my opinion, would probably be a good uh, strategy because there's so much to learn. Uh, every community is different. They have their own protocols. Um, you know, some speak Cree, some speak Ojibwe, some, you know, speak a, a different um, Indigenous language. Um, they each have their own cultures, so familiarizing yourself with um, the Indigenous community and say for instance a community that you were going to um, would be just the same as if you went to another country to conduct business.